Hey guys, what's up? It's Cena here, and um, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually, you know, set up your downloads after you download from my link, because a lot of people seem to, you know, have confusion on what to do with them. Uh, you know, I've had to help a lot of people via TeamViewer, so I'm just going to do this real quick so I can, you know, really end the confusion. You know, it'll be easier on both our parts. So, I'm going to do the, this is the Twitter uh, scanner portion, this is the auto add to cart portion. Let's do the auto add to cart first. So first, uh... You know, unzip it, so double click on it. And actually, now I have two on here, but I guess I'll throw this one away, you know, from before. But yours should just say one. But you want to open that? It doesn't matter, you know. So open it. Chrome. Autobuy.js. Uh, right click on it and open with text edit. Here you're going to see size 8. I don't know why that's the default. It's like the worst size, but whatever just change it to your size so I'm size 10 edited it should be saved all right let's just make sure it worked okay it worked so you can exit out of that now and I go to Chrome yeah you need Chrome to do this uh, tools extensions I deleted all my extensions so I could just do it again for you guys. Um, so yeah, normally this is not going to be checked. Check it and they should pop up. Use load unpack extension on your desktop. You should see that folder. So this is actually mine. Double click on that and then select Chrome. So then just press select. And you got your auto add to cart. And I'm going to show you guys that it works real quick. So let's open a new. bookmarks I've bookmarked this shoe because it's always in stock and it's a good thing to demonstrate on my internet's really slow right now I don't understand why but it should work a lot faster than this so see it automatically added to my cart I'm just remove it real quick okay so now that I have my auto add to cart set let's do the Twitter. So the Twitter, you want to unzip that. Get this should be like some weird Twitter CW0017. Open it up. Twitter scan.js. Now you want to open that with text edit. And here you're gonna see this is the key. It's all you need to edit here is keyword, which right now is Jordan. I'm gonna keep it that way because that's what I'm gonna use for the Dornbecker threes coming out this weekend. I'm pretty sure that's gonna work fine. So I'm just going to leave it like that. But, you know, normally if you guys want, like, the LeBrons, you know, you can just... It's case sensitive, so you'd have to do, like, uppercase L, lowercase E, uppercase B. Because, you know, LeBron's like that, so... All right, but I'm just keeping it as Jordan. That should work fine. And now that you have this folder here, go back to Tools Extensions. And load on pack extension again. Desktop. And that Twitter CW0017. Yeah, this thing. Just press select on that. And you should get this right here. Twitter 1. And so basically when you go on your Twitter now, it's going to be really weird. It's just going to automatically... See, I was test. See, it just worked. Just, I'll just prove the point. I wasn't even trying to do that, but I, I tweeted this earlier for myself. And see, it just automatically clicked on it, and it's going to automatically add to cart. Like it did in my other video. But see, it just worked. Um, normally, you should, like, let me just delete this real quick. So, say the, the release is coming out, you refresh it once. It should start automatically refreshing the page for you. See, it's automatically refreshing. And then you just wait it out. You start this, like, two minutes before 8, 8 a.m., which is, for me, uh, Eastern Time when the shoe is the tweet is shouted so that's pretty much how you set it up I think that covers everything uh, this is for Mac I'm gonna make it one for PC too because PC is actually the one that most people seem to have troubles with so uh, yeah I'm gonna stop the video here and I hope this helped you out if you still have any questions just message me alright bye